Well, the Philippines is being battered this morning by what may be the strongest storm ever recorded. And people in Chicago's Filipino community are nervously awaiting word on the fate of their loved ones. Nancy Lewis at a Filipino community center on the north side with more. Nancy? Well, Robin and Larry, the local Filipino community is significant with over 130,000 in the Chicago area. Many frequent the Rizal Center here on the north side. This morning, there's widespread worry because a lot of people can't reach their loved ones in the Philippines right now. Haiyan is known as Typhoon Yolanda in the Philippines, and it may be the strongest storm ever to make landfall anywhere in the world. The system is stronger than a Category 5 hurricane with sustained winds of nearly 200 miles per hour and gusts of 235. There are already reports of at least four deaths after the typhoon took direct aim at the province of eastern Visayas. Because many power lines and phone lines are down, the extent of the storm is not known, and Filipinos around the world are not able to reach their loved ones. Chicagoan Edmund Cruz has been trying to reach dozens of relatives by phone and on social media media to no avail. His mother is supposed to return to Chicago from Manila tomorrow. It's absolutely frustrating. You just want to hear a voice, hear a voice that you recognize, hear a voice that you know, just so you know everything is okay. And that part of not knowing, that's what's really killing me and it's, it really hurts not knowing. The Philippine Consul General in Chicago issued a statement last night calling on all compatriots and friends in Chicago and the Midwest to keep the Philippines in their thoughts and prayers. We're live at the Rizal Center on uh, the north side, Nancy Lou, WGN News.